to be the manager of a popular nightclub in Kisumu. Now, police have issued a public security warning, saying that the suspect is armed and dangerous. Bramo Bire reports. According to witness reports, the deceased Barack Otienu was in company of two others, Dona Kajuang and Marilyn Oma. The three revelers had hoped for a fun night at Donde's Hotel in Kisumu. They left the establishment together at around 3 a.m. It is reported that they proceeded to Victoria Garden's apartment where the fun turned to fury. At house number 55, the trio came face to face with the suspect, Colin Sokundi, who is a manager of Signature Club in Kisumu. A scuffle is reported to have ensued and the suspect disarmed Mama Ida Odinga's aide, shot him twice, killing him on the spot. The other male, Donna, was injured and is currently hospitalized. The lady in question, who is alleged to be Okundi's lover, escaped unhurt. Police have mounted a manhunt for the main suspect who escaped with the mother weapon. The commotion ensued between Okundi and the Dano. Wakati commotion ilianza between Okundi and Dano, seemingly ni kama wako na clunch. That's when Collins shot Barack Onyango. Fatally, hapo hapo tu. Kwa nchukua kumikia kwa. Uh, it is yet to be established that uh, the gun is used to organize the use. Of course, in short, one of them, one battle and others in charge. We are still investigating to confirm if we do feel where the barrack of Nyangu, Kama, the police and Kuana, the legal fire, because they are quite large. The Signature Club has, however, issued a press statement distancing itself from the unfortunate occurrence that led to the death of Barack Otieno.